Well, I'll hold this and then you. Mm. Got it. You're you're free of all electrical anything. Pretty sure. I just feel plastic, everyone. Oh, that was spooky. You shorted something. With the with the thing you shorted something, I think. Mm -hmm. And then of course I dropped it in and it's sucking in, so it pulled all the bags in there. Luckily it's spinning fast enough, it just shredded the bags. Did it melt that bag? Hold up. Is that tape or a bag? That's mm -hmm. tape. Shredded the bag a bit though. Yeah. So we may have to just accept that it uses a little bit of electric. Hmm. Yeah, unless we want to completely rejig the whole thing. And let's look around. Because we could just rejig it to be uh, just like remove all this and hook up our own wires to the actual motor in there. Yeah. yeah. And then bypass all this and just have the cord going to only that. And maybe keep the on off switch so we can just have that somewhere. Because this is all a bunch of resistance, isn't it? Yeah, it's all a bunch of pointless crap. And clearly, even when it's set to bypass it, it's still doing something. Yeah, yeah, it's got a, like a little bit of a feedback going to it. Where's the motors? There's, Where's what motors? Okay, so the blue wire goes to...